G'day all, Trog here, it's time for some more Space Engineers. So last episode I took on the Stingray and it was a real pain in the ass. Uh, it was a good little ship but just trying to capture it and get it moving was a pain. I'm definitely having issues with that but I think I've just accepted it and that's just how it's going to be. Uh, I think that definitely changed something in recent times since I first started this playthrough. Uh, but in a way, it's lucky they did because you know, I would have never maybe got these freighters <laughs> and built the ship. So who knows? Also, apologies for some of the recording in the last episode. I sounded like a robot a few times. I don't know why. Uh, I had been figuring around with the uh, my microphone settings a bit. Um, so yeah, that's obviously had something to do with it. Uh, I just need to get a decent microphone, I think, at some point. That's a job for another time. Okay, so all I've done since the last episode was I repaired the drone. So he's all fixed up now. And what else did I do? I can't even remember now. That was it, actually. I don't think I need to do much else. Uh, I'm just going to go and start taking off from the ship just to make sure I haven't missed any um, uh, no sort of dampeners, stabilizers. And so we've got the Corvette Miner down there, he's 12 k's away, uh, he's obviously just stopped. I thought about going and picking him up, but I just can't be bothered. I'm just going to leave it. It'll despawn or something, who knows, who cares. Alright, let's just start to move, see what happens. Actually, haven't left any dampeners on. Uh, just a quick one to that tank that I got from this Stingray. Uh, I've just put him there for now. We're pretty much full on oxygen, so but I will need some oxygen for when I build my rocket. Uh, I've been working on that, um, but yeah, having a little bit of trouble with it. I've basically taken someone else's design so far, and I'm trying to make it my own, which isn't really working. So I may just start from scratch. And there was a mayday at the end of the last episode, way out there somewhere, but I think I got out of its range, so it's no longer flashing. It may still be out there, but yeah, I don't really want to go searching for it when it's not flashing at me. So, let's continue the journey, and I'll see you when I find something. Alright, we've just come to a stop here because I saw a mayday. Now while we're on the fly then, uh, I tried to make a... Oh, there it is, down that way. Uh, I tried to make a telescope so that I could just look at these maydays um, and then decide what ship to take, but it just wasn't working. I tried to use a, a rotor and a hinge together and it was just that fiddly, I figure it's probably easier just to take a ship. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to take my favourite ship, the B, and go check this out. And remember to put the main ship antenna on. Oh, i got to repair him. Ah, oh, no! <gasps> Alright, there we go. Uh, he's a blue-eyed bee, and he has no nose. Worry about a nose another time. Alright, let's go. Uh, yeah, there it is. It looks like the big red ship. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure that is. Um, I've done that one before, like not too long ago, so... I'll see how I feel about doing it again. We'll get a bit closer and just confirm it. Okay, yeah, I think it's definitely the big red ship. Now, I've thought about it a little bit. Uh, I was going to give it a miss, just because I don't want to repeat too much. Uh, but at the end of the day, you know, like, I like doing these maydays. Um, and every time you do them, you know, you get a bit better at them. Uh, I did that, that pirate 
station uh, a couple of times recently and the first time I did it I really sucked at it that took me ages and then the second time you know I felt like I got a lot better and I did it really quick so who knows you know in the future I may do some tutorial videos on maydays and if I want to do that then I'm gonna have to do more of them more times and get better at them so I'm gonna just look at it like that Uh, yeah, I'm definitely not going to salvage this down, that's for sure. I just can't be bothered going back for the puffer fish and then <laughs> coming in and salvaging it. But, you know, we'll go in and just neutralise the guns at least. I, sh I got a message today from someone on another video. Um, just saying that even though Maydays, you know, you may repeat them, uh, they may be different, even though they're the same Mayday. So I don't know what that means, but maybe like guns will be in different locations or maybe it's just a different scenario. I'm not 100% sure, but it's definitely got me curious now. So I'll go in and have a look. Uh, it's probably not all Maydays. I'm sure he just means some of them, but yeah, it certainly intrigues me more to be willing to do some repeat ones. All right, let's get in there and find these guns. Uh, pretty sure I remember where they all are. Well, there's a Gatling gun for a start. I don't want to mess with that. Or should I just come straight in at it? Guns blazing. Try the guns blazing. Jesus, took a lot of ammo, um, uh oh, do we have a drone friend, oh we do, we do, whoa, what's going on, oh, get out of this view, oh I've had my ass taken out, I've lost my ass, there's another drone, oh no, I've lost my hydrogen. Oh shit. Oh, the bee's fucked. Alright, let's go see if we can get some revenge on this drone here. Yeah, not much left to him either. Let's get his uranium. Let's split him down the middle. What do you reckon? 
Oh, he had a warhead on him. Jesus. Another one. No, he was a grinding drone. He's still trying to grind me. <laughs> Back off. Alright, well. And afraid of spawned in. Bloody hell, all happening. Well, here comes another drone. Oh, he's a grinding drone. Haha, <laughs> you got nothing. Oh shit, what now? Oh, another one. Yeah, I'm gonna get between you and your friend. Shoot your friend. Yeah, yeah, I know. Jesus. Alright, this is not very good. Whoa. Alright. Uh, I don't know what to do here. I think I need to get out of here. Alright, where is this fucker? Which one is he? There's so many signals out there. Still got my guns at least. Alright. Yeah, this is more like it. Oh shit, he's still shooting. It's off. Yeah, right, I think he's down. Is he still shooting me? I'm gonna get back to the main ship. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna bring in the big guns. Yeah, you know, I can't let these drones just do this to me. Fucking hurt my bee and shit. They need to be taught a lesson. And there's no better way to be taught a lesson than by a puffer fish. <laughs> All right, I've just come back in the bee, and I didn't realise the drones are following me. Oh, Jesus. Now that was a long ride back, I've got to tell you, just on these thrusters. I also am missing a uh, thruster going in one of the directions, so it's really hard to slow down. can't believe those drones were following me that whole time. That's crazy. Now this is more exciting. Let us take out that grinder just in case. I don't want that near my big ship. Now the one's fucked. Good. Alright, uh, so now we're going to go in with a puffer fish. It's time. They're probably shooting bits and pieces. Let's go do this. I think we're getting close to it now. I am glad I looked at this now because I don't remember this spawning drones like that last time I did it. But it did nothing. 
I remember it being quite easy. There was the, the Gatling gun that took out my fighter. Uh, that's because I didn't know where it was. I didn't see it until it was too late. Uh, but apart from that, yeah, there's definitely no drones spawned, so... Something new. So I guess the plan here is to get the puffer fish in there to cover me. Uh, cover the drones. Uh, hopefully I can just go in there and disable whatever turrets there are and the aerials, antennas, what do you want to call them. And yeah, it looks like I definitely took out that Gatling gun already, so that's, you know, that's a plus. Uh, I know there's at least two interior turrets on it. I think I know approximately where they are, so hopefully I can avoid them or take them out pretty quick. Now, I don't want to get too close to the puffer fish because my gun will just start shooting any old random block. I just want it to be close enough that it will cover me from the drones like that. Yeah, I reckon this will be enough. Uh, whoops, getting too close here. Back off, boy, back off. I guess he now starting to shoot everything. We don't want that. Alright, I'm just going to reverse out past 800 metres out of range. There we go. And already I can see a drone. Jobs guns, oh, they're not quite. Oh, you two face. Good thing I have a survival kit on this. If I can work out what direction I'm going in. Bloody. Oh, come on. Kill it, mate. Kill it. Alright, I think he's down. Alright, just gotta get my body back. And survey what damage just happened. Jesus. Fucking prick. Oh, look at that, that's a mess. Well, I ain't repairing that. Uh, this cop's some damage too. Jesus. Alright. Now, I think the problem was the guns weren't really facing it on a good angle. So, I'm just gonna do this. There we go.
Fucking hell. Alright. Uh, where is it? Oh, there's another drone. Yeah. Uh, I've lost sight of the big red ship now. There it is. Alright, we'll come back and salvage that drone after. Let's get this antenna down if we can, ASAP. Hey, whoops. Inventory Alright, that should be enough. Um, now it's these interior turrets. Pretty sure there's one in here somewhere. Yep, there he is. Whoops. I have 27 health left. Not a good time to be taking on a turret. Uh, you know what? I'm going to go back and get my health back. Guys, chill out. Uh, all right. I'm just gonna take that aerial out completely because I feel like it's still producing drones. Yeah, yeah. yeah let's just try to get out this turret. Dude. Ah, shoot me for that tiny little gap. Help low. Fuck. Eat that. Alright, just need to find a cargo container. A conveyor. Ah, oh, whatever. And now I know there's one more turret on this section. There we go, dump my shit in there. Oh, I've got some missiles. That's what's taking up all my inventory space. Oh, there it is there. Look, on the ceiling. Wake up, fuck ass. Alright, now I think that's it. So what is that? Is there a beacon on this? Okay, there is a beacon, but I don't think they call drones. There it is. Inventory full. All right, I believe this is mine now. I'll just double check the turrets everywhere else. Got a gravity generator, that's good. Uh, pretty sure there's no turret on this. And I do remember last time doing this, I couldn't even find a bloody control panel to take over to double check. But It's got the full hydrogen tank, um, but yeah, I don't need hydrogen at the moment. Oh shit, there's a warhead.
Okay. Yeah, I don't remember that being there last time either. Jeez. All right. Um. Uh, uh, <laughs> I don't know what to do. Uh. I guess I could just grind it down, unless there's a sensor in there somewhere. But I don't. I don't see any batteries on this either. So. Well, you don't need a. Uh, I don't think you need a battery for a warhead, but you do need one for a sensor. Well, let's find out. There, yeah, all right. Okay, it was armed. Okay, no sensors or nothing else on here. Maybe it was just there for, I don't know. They just hope you hit it and blow it up. Let's do that. I mean, if they want an explosion, let's make one. Yeah. Now, yep, there goes all that hydrogen. That makes my decision for that pretty easy. Uh, Alright, well, I think I will bring the puffer fish in and we'll do a bit of salvage. Um, I know I said I wasn't gonna, but I also wasn't expecting to lose so much Your of my ships. Is low. Yeah, I know, lady. Um, so, yeah, I kind of feel like I need some resources back now. I mean, we're good for resources, but, you know, you can never have too many, can you? So I think I'll do that, um, and then yeah, I'm gonna have to do a shitload of repairing. I, I really thought that this big red ship was just gonna be a bit of a smash and grab, you know, just come in and take out the turrets, just grab a few nice things, and that would be it, but it's actually been quite different. Uh, I'm, I'm glad I did it, um, I'm glad I took that dude's advice and you know, gave it a go. It's, it was definitely different than last time. Um, I mean, I don't know if they, maybe they're all like that. They do spawn drones, but for some reason the last one I had didn't, or if it's just quite random. Don't know. But yeah, that was definitely way harder and way more interesting. I liked it. I'm not going to like repairing all my ships though. Man, look at all this debris. That's sick. Alright, so I'm going to move the puffer fish in, do some salvaging, and I'll see you after that. Alright, so there's the salvaging done. Uh, I've just done all the important stuff, as usual. I don't think I've left anything behind there. It's just all the, uh, the plates and whatnot. So yeah, I just had a little survey of damage that I copped during the battle with the drones then. Um, the puffer fish copped a bit of damage down here, which that shouldn't be too hard to repair. Um, pretty much nothing else got damaged on the puffer fish, but obviously the uh, Hornet got absolutely decimated. Uh, I've been considering just retiring the Hornet now, now that I have the bee. Well, I'm going to repair the bee, of course. But uh, yeah, maybe the Hornet will become obsolete, I don't know yet. It's pretty easy to rebuild anyway if I... Well, not rebuild, but just build another one from scratch. So, do that if I really feel I need it. Uh, the drone didn't cop nothing, uh, but this copped a lot of damage. The old tugboat. Not much left of him. Uh, but the battery's there, that's the main thing. So, I can rebuild onto that, that's fine. So yeah, we sustained a lot of losses during that battle, but that was all good, all in the name of entertainment, and I was entertained, and I hope you were too. Alright, I'll meet you back at the scuzzle, but... Okay, just coming to dock here. And we're good. Make sure I turn everything off. Alright, now, unfortunately, as I was coming into dock, I see we've lost some solar panels. And I don't know how that's happened. Uh, I do remember the guns were shooting at something through the solar panels, but I don't remember seeing any of them get completely destroyed. 
So that's a bit disappointing. Hmm, not good. Um, the only other thing I can think of is... Was there a grinding drone let loose still? I wouldn't have thought so. I don't see any other damage. So yeah, it was definitely me just shooting through them. Friendly fire. Well, I'm going to have to repair that at some point. That's a bit of a bummer. Um, you know, I've been struggling for solar cells like for ages to complete this and then this is pretty much complete so <laughs> annoying oh well um, so during the time that I've been editing this episode uh, there's been an update it's the the warfare 2 broadside update and it's funny because earlier in this episode I was talking about making a telescope from a uh, rotor and a what was it a hinge but now they actually do have a uh, like a component in the game that pretty much does what i was trying to make i just think that's kind of funny seeing as i was literally just trying to make one let's have a look at it so here it is the search lot we'll just chuck one of them on and i'll check it out Yeah, right. well he's kind of facing the wrong way, but that's okay. Alright, and I believe you need to be in a control station to sort this thing out. And if we go into control, and then there you go. It's just like a camera that you can move around. Oh look, there must be pieces pieces of a drone out there. I'll go check that out in a minute. So yeah, pretty cool. Um, the only thing is, obviously the zoom is, you know, where we're at. Here we go. So it's just the same as a camera, which isn't great, but, you know, it's okay. Um, so probably maydays that are, you know, 20Ks away, this may not be very helpful for. But at the same time, it might just give us a little bit of an idea what we're up against and help me decide what ship to take in. Look at the alien planet, by the way. It's like so close. So yeah, pretty cool. I'll just go see what's left of this drone out here. Now where was it? Eh, not much. Might get some uranium out of it though. Okay, so that's that. Um, that was pretty cool how this little light just searches around. Obviously there was plenty of other mods. Um, some rail guns and some new weapons. Uh, I'm looking forward to trying them out, but you know, I'll have to uh, take the time to do that. I can't just get straight into it. Uh, oh, I really need to hook this bee up now. And then we can get moving. Alright, I'm just going to hook up a landing gear for now. Just hook him up because uh, I want to really want to get motoring here. <laughs> Alright, that was a bit harder than I thought. There's, we've got one thruster missing in one direction, uh, which makes it hard. Man, he really copped it in the ass, didn't he? Poor bugger. Alright, so I'm just going to cruise along now until I find another Mayday and then we're going to end the episode there. Okay, just coming to a stop here. I wasn't travelling for very long at all. Uh, maybe about 5-10 minutes. Uh, and then there's a Mayday up here somewhere. So, it's about 18 k out. This is a chance to test it out spotlight camera system. Alright, so it was sort of straight up out that way somewhere. I'm probably going to have to wait for it to blink again. But I am ready. There we go. Yep, I can just see a little shiny object. Okay, it's something blue. <laughs> It looks quite small. 
Yeah, it'd be nice if they had some sort of a uh, like a zoom boost on this. I'm sure there's going to be a script out there for that soon or a mod. All right, that looks like something small. I'm pretty sure I could just take in a small ship. Uh, so the B and everything, I've got no fighter at this point in time. So I'm going to have to end the episode there. And between episodes, I'm going to repair the B. Uh, I'm going to repair the tugboats. Uh, probably repair the solar sail. Just do some tinkering around, all the boring stuff. And at the start of the next episode, we'll be going in and checking out this Mayday. So, we'll look forward to that. So, I hope to see you in the next one. And thanks for watching. And I'll see you then. Laters.